Hello, this is Ronnie. I'm back here with a clip taken from a long video that I just finished to record for my subscribers. I'm leaving the option for my services at 50% off for the first year open and I'll be providing further details after the clip ends. So if you're interested, please stay on. I'll be talking to you again at the end of the uh, clip. I would like you also to read carefully the disclaimer that I'm going to put up now so that uh, it is clear to you before you uh, go ahead and watch the video. This is uh, just a standard thing. This is uh, the chart of Xal, that is the good on silver sector index and you can see the rebound from support. It didn't even have to deep under that. Uh, it rebounded, the, the entire price action is consistent with lateral movement that is going to build over the next several days and will eventually serve as a launching pad to send it even higher. So the wave count is intact. There is absolutely nothing to do and nothing to change. Um, when something works you just get out of the way you get out of the way and you don't try to second guess you don't try to second guess you obviously have a big movement here you can see the power on the weekly there, there was a lot of support for the 21 and 50 confluence right here uh, it managed to run high and pierce through the resistance what are we going to start changing and messing up with this we just have to leave it alone it's it is going to do what it's going to do and right now the signals that it has given us it wants to go higher. Great. Here's the gold box index. That's the age UI. That's the 15 minutes. And look, it's consistent with a fourth wave. Fourth wave, again, it's working. It's looking good. The momentum is looking good. It's strong. It's holding on to most of the gains. Why would we mess up with it? Silly. We shouldn't do anything. Just leave it. That's a one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four, five. It could even have a scare, uh, if you like, trying to dislodge some longs uh, by dipping down here. It will not kill uh, the momentum necessarily, even if, you know, you get this, uh, an intraday spike like that it, and it comes back. That, in fact, reinforces the, uh, the wave count. I'm now going to clean it a bit here. The arrows did their job and i i think they're going to stay around here okay so we are now um in a fourth wave that is uh on the scale of the second wave that we have seen here so it's not going to be ready to run through the roof right away okay we're going to have further lateral movement over several days maybe for a week well, there's nothing wrong with it absolutely perfect stuff no problem whatsoever no problem whatsoever that's the daily it's making that move to a higher ground that requires uh, our patience yes we've got to stand on the sidelines and not mess up with it it has stored the energy for a long time to make this swing up and now it's underway great we just have to let mr market uh do what appears to be unfolding here and not get in the way Is the chart of uh, the GDX that's the four hour scale also here the rebound from support back the, the entire thing looks clearly as corrective and when you go to the 15 minutes and you see this for example this is a uh, super clear A B C okay absolutely no problem that could turn out also into an A B C even if it dips there is nothing wrong there is absolutely nothing wrong here this is just consolidation fourth wave perfect perfect that was my idea that it'll just trail sideways here um, that's a sign again that things are 
uh, on the way to high ground. He's the daily. There's nothing to do. Just hang around here. This is a few days of uneventful price action. Uh, you didn't buy, you didn't miss uh, much. You can actually still get in because the move is going to go above 46. That's the idea. It's an impasse wave. Here's silver. That's the daily. Silver is resting on the 10 moving average, resting on horizontal support. Um, is it necessarily going up? No, not necessarily. It could go there and it's not going to be the end of the world for silver. Not at all, because according to the wave count that I put forward here, which is not a high confidence wave count. OK, I already told you it's not high confidence. We're going to wait for more price action to help us sort out the wave count here. This looks like a one, two, three, four, five. Fine. That'll be your A. That's a B. Uh, meaning A, B, C, basically that could be an X, that could be another A, B, C. No problem. So it goes down to 26.80, 26.60. That's not a reason for you to throw in the towel thinking it's going to go there. No, no, no. I don't think so. You do what you want, of course. I think this will be coming. Now, how about this going up? What will be the next move? Well, I'm going to show you that it is not necessarily going to fly through the roof uh it might do something like that would that would that be enough to throw you of course if you are if you are bull shouldn't shouldn't you should stay in you should stay in this range here could become a trading range for the next several days uh and even dipping in panic towards 2680 you sit calm you wait for the strength uh, to manifest here, as I think it will, and uh, it's going to be pushed back up. Okay, we've got gold here, the commodity itself, that's the 60 minutes, and uh, we worked with one wave count that looks to be already under pressure. Uh, we have presented this as a possible on the two-hour scale is a possible one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. If that's the case, it should really come correcting way, way, way down somewhere here. Okay, it doesn't look like it is uh, fancying doing this. It is still fairly strong in a tight range. So we might have to introduce some changes here, especially if it goes back up, uh, even if it continues here for another day or two and it goes back up. Uh, this is no longer one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Um, on the whole, I think that um, given the strength that we are seeing in the gold, the various gold indices, yes, and the funds, um, there is not really a big co cause for concern uh, for the bulls. You see all the moving averages. That's the 10, 21, 50, 200. It's sitting on top of all of them. And some of them, of course, turning up very nicely. Uh, it is now battling overhead resistance here. Clear, clear. Overhead resistance right here. 1,900, uh, 1,860 or so. I think it's up to up to the task of actually climbing uh, above this wall of resistance. But the ingredient that is missing, as in many, many cases, the ingredient that is missing at this point is patience. Uh, my website, the homepage, is right here. It's uh, Wave Mastery, www at wavemastery.com. Yeah, point uh, Wave Mastery in one word, dot com. That takes you to the homepage. You can uh, scroll down, look through some things that I've written here, some recommendations from past users and current users. And that is essentially the offer currently open uh, only to first time subscribers. OK, so there is the daily service, uh, daily videos that are preceded by trial. So you can take the trial for uh, one week. And at the end of that, if you're happy, you do nothing. You go on to the plan of um, half price, essentially 79 presents half price of the normal price. And that will be good for one year. That means uh, 12 um payments of 79 uh if you want to watch just the weekend videos then you go for this one 
and uh, it does give you access to um, the weekend videos and uh, I often also insert a video as a bonus uh, midweek just to keep you on track to see a little bit uh, you know where things are moving because sometimes one week of full price action is a lot and the wave count can change especially if you're a short-term trader uh, you really want to know uh, what's happening so that is essentially the situation if you decide to go for example for the daily videos you uh, click here it takes you to the page where it explains to you you should read that it explains to you what um, what is covered etc etc if you like what you read you click here subscribe it takes you to uh, PayPal uh, because of my uh, paying system is through PayPal and um, you pay through PayPal you can see you have the trial at 9.99 that's uh, for the first seven days as I said if you like what you see do nothing it just it just goes automatically if you don't like you can cancel or if you don't know how to cancel or you have any doubt you have any question you can write to me of course uh, once you go through and you pay you come back uh, PayPal will send you back to my website uh, to um, fill in your um, profile details uh, choose your login and uh, once you do that you will be led uh, automatically to the page with uh, with the links to the various videos classified by date if at any point in time in this process you have a problem things are not going uh, as I'm describing to you right now all you have to do is just contact me and I'll help you out um, that is essentially it so um, you have one week to look at things I would like to just spend a minute uh, about the website itself I have written here a few articles uh, is this website for me you can go through that one psychology and trading trading and the arts why join yes each of these articles uh, could uh, perhaps uh, help you to to see um, how to relate to my website but there's no substitute in my opinion to actually take a trial you know you take a trial and I want to say another thing you take a trial and you can't make up your mind you want more time to think fine I understand that then you cancel but then you are not allowed to take another trial please I want to be very clear about that there are people who abuse this and it's really um, not right uh, you're not allowed to take more than one trial okay a trial is a trial but if you're interested after you take a trial you're interested to come back you can still benefit from the low price for the next full year but you have to write to me and then I will send you a special link without a trial and, and, and if you join then you're going to go immediately onto the reduced price plan for 12 months okay uh, if you take another trial after you took already one I am going to have to cancel that and refund you and if you do that two or three times I'm just going to blacklist you because there are people who have been doing it and I'm afraid this is really absolutely not right um, this is subscribe here uh, use subscription once you are uh, once you are logged in you will see this one highlighting you uh, uh, daily service videos or weekend service videos yeah it will show which one you really um, um, have the right to, to access the daily service videos to be very clear they cover the weekend service videos okay so you don't have to subscribe to both the daily covers everything I do the weekend of course is more selective now I have here resources there are chart galleries right here uh, chart one two three there are plenty plenty of chart uh, charts here that give you uh, an idea how I go about uh, uh, subdividing uh, various uh, market action here there I covered a lot a lot of markets and you can see there is history here that could be very interesting for you to just go through let's see platinum for example yes that's 1973 to 1978 if you click right on top where it shows you the hand the chart opens up big you can print it if you like um, here is an example of platinum April um, uh, 1980 uh one two three four five and then the huge correction that followed after that uh, so they, there is plenty for you whichever market you're interested uh interested in the financials uh, commodities precious metals etc uh okay so that chart galleries 
then useful links as it as the name implies yes recommended reading list you have uh, a long list of uh, books here that I've read over the years that I found very interesting of course I have many more books that uh, I would like to add it's just a question of time I don't always have time to update this one but the books that you find here uh, did help me in the beginning and still uh, the information here is very valuable in these books for example crawl I don't know how many of you heard about Stanley crawl Stanley crawl was um, a really imaginative fellow trader uh, that wrote um, wrote very well about his own trading and in trading in general I learned a lot from uh, from these books and of course uh, if you haven't heard about uh, reminiscence of a stock operator you should uh, get this book and read it uh, you will not regret uh, this is uh, uh, a book that um, most traders I think uh, have come across and read it is very very interesting and uh, as you go down the list you will see there are things that are of interest to you uh, of course uh, go ahead get them some of them are in, even available online for free as a PDF uh, check that uh, if you have questions about that you can even uh, contact me here's the contact us and you uh, put your name please make sure you give me the right email address message simple maths submit I get it you'll hear from me I'm based in Belgium so if you write to me from Australia or from the US and I'm having uh, my rest do not be surprised if I don't react quickly okay uh, normally within uh, within a day you will have a reply for me I, I check my email uh, uh, fairly regularly so that's about it hope to see you visiting my website hope to see you taking a trial um, if you have any questions again don't hesitate get in touch with me and uh, wishing you great trading week bye now